What's up guys, welcome back to the channel, and yes, I'm wearing the same thing because I literally just shot these two next to each other. So this is the second box, it's a little bit bigger than the last box. Um, probably because of the item that I had to order that was on back order. Um, just because I've been wanting to get it, and the last time they had it in order, or in, in stock, I uh, put it in my cart, came back that night after dinner, and it was already sold out so that didn't work out so let me keep that like that, 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 that. all right so huh oh yeah <laughs> let's see what the first thing i got is dark sleepers half ounce dark sleeper again smallmouth bait but he's killed him up there last year, so I had to grab him. Um, I got him in the blue tan and then the brown orange. I don't know what the colors are. Uh, that's Donko. And this is Mudisagoro. Mudisagoro, maybe? Um, awesome baits again. Uh, you just crawl them on the bottom. They absolutely destroy them. It just imitates a goby or a goby um, down there. So... It's awesome. I had to pick up a Air Martins, another one of the Citrus Shads. Um, I used it all last year and I lost it, so I had to pick one up for the spring. Um, so it's a good time to throw this right now. Awesome bait. I wish they'd make one smaller though. I wish they'd make one the size of a 1.5. Hopefully they will. Yeah. Picked up another pack of Egg Zone Tubes. This is Touchdown. This is the uh, green pumpkin blue kind of pearl color. Uh, I use this color a lot. This is a great color here. Again, this is a, uh, what size is this? This is the 375 as well. So I'll use these around here as well. And I'll use those up in Michigan and Wisconsin. Got more dark sleepers in the same colors because you can't just have one. You got to double up. Got more spark shads. This is the Hi-Yo, Hi -Yo, which is essentially just white pearl. No more Hios, white pearl, three inch. I got the uh, Okashira screw heads in white, the eighth ounce as well. Um, just the eighth ounce, just because I'm throwing on my BFS stuff and that's just a great size. I didn't want to go to 16th. I picked up a hog farmer. Uh, what is this? Tactical Bass and Flex Rig 5. Because if we are going to be in the pre-pre-spawn up there, a rig bite is always on fire. So I picked up one of these guys. It's actually pretty nice. Um, Hog Farmer has always made really nice A-rigs. It comes with the dummy screws already in it, which is kind of nice. And then the three in the bottom. Uh, so yeah, that's going to be a great little uh, rig. Yeah, it's pretty quality. comes with split rings. Ooh, split rings. Keep the guy together. All right, what else we get? Back of warehouse, old school shirt. Looks like more duos, duos. Got in, this is a great color up on St. Clair. This is the 5A in there, orange craw. Uh, pumpkin craw, great colors there. See what else I got. This is Ghost Gill. Ghost Gill 5As. Great colors there. A uh, couple more baits are falling down. Vibe 62 Apexes. If the bite is on the pre-spawn, we absolutely destroy them on uh, traps on the flats. So we want the reds. The reds have been killing it the last couple years. And then the chrome, the chrome shag colors, chrome greens, perch, all that kind of stuff. Um, these are the 62s, awesome baits, they're super thin. Duo makes a phenomenal bait. And then the last but not least is Lawrence, three in one. Three in one nose cone for the troll motor. So I can do 
down imaging and I can have it for the Ghost 360, which is the update that came out earlier this year. And that's why everybody bought them out so they could do 360 on their Ghost. Um, yeah, they're really hard to get. So I snagged one before they are completely sold out. So I might actually do an install video on this because I hear it's pretty easy to do. So that is it. That is the haul. That is the St. Clair home little replenish for now. So awesome. Smash it up. Post down below. Appreciate you guys. Have a good one. Peace.